Honestly, uh, this this in one form or another has happened throughout history. You know, you had buggy whip producers, sure. and they moved on and did learn to do other things. You had cashiers; they're arguably not necessary even today. So, you completely know, the, not necessary. So, yeah. so what's the solution to that? Yeah, I'll tell you what it was what it was for me. I was a high school dropout. I had no future. Mm. Education. Right. So, you know, I think the big, big problem we have now is we're not training people. We're not giving them good groundwork, uh, good foundations in order to achieve in a different way. You know, the world isn't going to stay static. It isn't. Progress is going to happen. You will have self-driving cars. You will have automation everywhere taking over, you know, like it already building a car. It's largely a robotic, robotic assembly line. Yeah. 40 years ago, there were people in there with, you know, with glue guns. <laughs> yeah, glue guns and, and <laughs> screwdrivers and putting stuff together. Lug nuts. Yeah. That's right. Like, exactly. And, and so that progress is happening. You yeah. can't stop it. Right. I mean, you, you can try your best, but all you're going to do is. Well, some people think you're just going to give everybody a universal basic income, a you, free check every month. I don't, what do you I don't think of that? that? I don't agree with that. I, don't, I, I think you need to treat people who are unable to make a living treat them with with dignity and respect but at have the a same, safety net you're not uh, a, yeah, a yeah, safety net safety of course yeah. i mean i mean it's not social it's just being a human yeah and so i think that is a really important way but education to me yeah. is at the key uh it also the more educated people get the more informed they are right, right. that's part of what it is it's putting information in so you're informed becoming unignorant right and when you do that you empower yourself yeah. so it doesn't matter what you do going forward you're more empowered by putting this knowledge in you have more facilities equipment to deal with the problems yeah and you'll get you'll find a new job you'll find a new job building something or right. you will invent something or you'll work at a higher level in a different kind of job so uh, i i just find that the big flaw in the way our current government is dealing with this, it's not focused enough on the education. Now, I, of course, I come from a very educational background, yeah. and it's, I've seen how it transformed my life. I, I grew up in Lubbock, Texas. You couldn't find, or Plainview, you couldn't find a more desolate place and, and, and depressing place, the last picture show place. Yeah. And, and uh, essentially, you've got to elevate. I mean, I've got family there that are still stuck and... They're desperately holding on, right? right? They never educated themselves. Right. So I could be, I could have been just like that, but I got out and got an education. And not everyone's going to do the amount that I do, but you can get an education and get out and change your life. Education got pretty expensive these days, and it seems like one of these things we can't okay, take you know, control I, of. What are your thoughts you know, on that? Well, I think we've got a lot of private universities that don't do anything for you. Right. Yeah. You, you, I mean, a lot of these debts that have been built up by students are, are for going to some... I don't want to know how to use the word. Essentially, dipshit university that Love. has no reason for being there. Right. Okay. They don't provide an education. They're all profit based. Right. We've got a perfectly good education system, and instead of giving students loans to go to these nonsense places, right. make sure that they don't get a loan, and and that they're going for something that will yield value when they're done. Right. Trade schools especially seem to be... Pretty, I don't care what it is, yeah. but it should be a real, authentic place instead of for-profit bullshit. Yeah. I, by the way, I taught at one of those places when I was first out of the Navy. I taught some computer programming. I mean, they're rip-offs. Right. I mean, I... It's, it's very sad to see this. They, they get GIs. Uh, people come out on the GI Bill. They get a little bit of a loan, and they think they're going to teach them IT support, and they wind up teaching them nothing. They end up learning nothing. They learn nothing. They they're spend in all debt. their money. Yeah. And someone walks away with it, and yeah. I think it's it's criminal. It's criminal. I, you know, I mean, I can't tell you the number. I'm not going to mention any of, the, any of them by name, but there's right. a number of schools like that. Yeah. Supported by very important people. Right. And supported by Congress, supported by our politicians, who will give student loans, allow that to happen. That's one place that the government's failing dramatically, is not enforcing that people who get an education or are paying for an education get a good education. Yeah, and that it matches some kind of employment afterwards. Right. Hey, everybody, let me take a moment to tell you about the awesome Squarespace. I use Squarespace all the time. I think I've created a half dozen websites this year alone. Launch Angel Summit, 
founder.university, angel.university, uh, every one of our websites we put onto Squarespace here at launch and we love it. It costs us 10, 20 bucks a month to have an amazing, gorgeous website and they will even give you a free domain name if you start up for a year. So start your free trial today. No credit card is required. You get a free domain name if you sign up for a year. And if you decide to sign up for Squarespace after the trial, use the promo code TWIST and you will get 10% off your first purchase. You will have a professionally designed website. You can pick from all these amazing, beautiful templates and it works everywhere on mobile, on your desktop, on a wide monitor, on a small monitor, on an iPad, on an iPhone, Android. It doesn't matter what you're using. It will look beautiful. State-of-the-art tech, secure and stable. It can withstand massive amounts of traffic when you go vile, vi when you go viral, and it's trusted by millions, including some of the most respected brands in the world. I am a huge fan of Squarespace. Thank you to Squarespace, and make sure you use that promo code TWIST. So we do it with our in-house creative and our content staff, not by hiring expensive developers. Thanks to my friends at Squarespace. Okay. Mm -hmm.